predefined functional interface is called consumer team predefined okay, functional interface is called consumer okay team now you know when we should go for consumer when we should go for this consumer hey in our project requirement in our project requirement if the method if the method does not return anything then it is called consumer if the method does not return anything that means it is a void methods it is called consumer if the method does not return anything does not return anything 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 then it is called it is called consumer functional interface it is called consumer functional interface it is called consumer functional interface please team if the method does not return anything then it is called consumer functional interface okay team so that means that means these are called void methods that means these are called you know void methods void methods, void methods number one number two and number two so now predicate till now we have okay, discussed comma function okay, interfaces are interfaces will return will return we will, will return a value value but but consumer consumer does not return does not return any value but consumer does not return any value any value team again types of the consumers again how many types of the consumers can anyone guess team how many types of the consumer can anyone guess team one is one is one argument consumer one argument consumer other one is two argument consumers two argument consumers other one is team other one is primitive consumers primitive consumers new consumer okay so now first one see team one argument one argument consumer one argument consumer team to understand stream apis all are very very important team one argument consumer team hey one argument in consumer is nothing but if the input is if the input is only one argument if the input is only one argument then it is called it is called one argument consumer it is called one argument consumer if the input is only one if the input is only one then it is called one argument consumer no output team no okay output here how these methods are there you know here public interface consumer here only okay input no more output now here how many methods are there because it is a functional interface it is a functional interface a functional interface will have only one abstract method that abstract method is called void accept accept means you are accepting only one input only one input and also a functional interface will have and also a functional interface will have default methods also would be there a functional interface will have 
default methods also will be there that default method is called and then and then and then is the default methods and then is the default method always you know it will be your okay, input also is a consumer and output also it will be okay, input is the consumer and output also will be now here consumer output also would be consumer now, it, this is called default methods default methods team it is called abstract method team abstract method team okay if the input will have only one argument then it is called you know it is called one argument consumer now same dialog same same pattern can i use team for two argument can i use call it two argument two arguments here is this two two argument consumer if the input is okay if the okay, input will okay if the okay, input has if the okay, okay input has two arguments if the okay, input has two arguments if the okay, input has two arguments two arguments then it is called if the okay, input has two arguments then it is called by consumer it is called two argument consumer or by consumer it is called two argument consumer are called by consumer team by consumer all are very very important to understand your stream apis to understand your stream apis team if the input has two arguments then it is called two argument consumer then it is called two argument consumer team okay team let's see if it is two argument now here here also you will have by consumer consumer c by consumer c by consumer t okay we'll see practically you will be able to know once we are good within this then we'll start to write on uh, what is the primitive what is the primitive team okay right now we'll start go to our coding now new class com dot cinotech dot com dot cinotech dot you should go for consumer consumer demo consumer demo consumer demo now we'll see what is this consumer demo team now we'll see how to implement this consumer demo i have list of okay employees i have have a list of okay, employees team already i have some okay, employees stuff is there if it is not there we could add okay, it's not a problem i am using this same employee again and again same employee again and again team let's see i'm taking here where in consumer i am taking the okay, list of okay, employee list of okay, employee okay now oh, good okay next one so okay, instead of okay time waste team i have copy paste all the employees list team what is my okay, requirement is see the requirement first requirement okay i want just to print i want just to print all employee all employee names team i want just to print all okay employee names how to print consumer consumer input is employee input is employee employee now c is equal to, c is equal to, um, okay employee e arrow e arrow here we need to write our lambda of okay, expressions 
lambda i am not writing too much of this lambda here here i i used to do all the employee objects what is employee object emp id now i should do e dot get emp id similarly i should do print all emp name salary i should do print all emp name salary EMP name employee ID, employee name, employee ID name, sorry, e dot get e dot employee get salary it's not there go to this employee integer it is okay no problem get salary get salary no emp dot get address team that's it now i want to print like this i'm closing this lambda expression once you close this lambda expression now what happened here get employee employee e colon e colon now here list team see how i am calling here consumer c dot accept see how many methods are there two methods are there one is accept another one is another one is and then so i am calling accept now i am calling accept now c dot accept of accept of what you should do here uh, you know c dot accept of e team i would call every employee i should call you know so okay every okay accept okay every okay employee I should call this one. It will only print output. Okay, does not return anything. Output is not returning anything. Only here okay, input is only output is called wide method city. Output is called wide methods. Run as Java application. That's it. See, employee one, I got this. Employee two, I got this. Employee three, I got this. For separation, but employee details are. Details are separation employee details are okay. now that's it team every employee it would be okay, okay executed first employee details second employee details third employee details that's it team employee details are got it team that's it team any questions team here this is one simple example how to do now people are asking hey can we write i want to see one use case i want to see one of use case question can we can we uh, you know can we implement 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 all predicate comma function comma consumer consumer all in can we implement all can we implement a predicate function consumer in one one scenario yes depends upon the requirement you should use answer is yes yes same okay, employee only okay okay we'll take so okay, list of okay, employee predicate means i want filter Filter the employee salary greater than or less than 10,000. If anyone is there, okay, I want to filter 10,000. Okay, you only will add or less than okay, 20,000. You can give less than filter the employee 
salary less than 20,000. Done. Who, whoever is okay, 20,000 details are there. Apply. Apply some. Now here. Function. Apply. Okay. Apply your okay, increment. Okay, increment salary. 5,000 for all the employees. Whoever is less than 21 is there. Whoever got, you know, less than 20k. Once all is done, right? What this consumer will do? Hey, consumer, okay, display that data. That's it. Consumer, okay, display, you know, what this I'm informing to consumer. Okay, display all the data. Okay, okay, that's it. Okay, display all the data. That's it. Depends upon the requirement. You should go for this. Okay, you okay, use case team. Let's see. Same example. I am applying for all. All means it is one use case. Another use case is one one use case. It is. Another use case is apply. Go for next example. New class. Educate. Consumer. Function. Demo. Educate. Consumer. Function. Demo. Now what happened? I want to use this same that's why wherever you are using frequent logic right in your real time move this logic to okay, okay, utility class move this logic to okay you, you are okay, utility class how to move write one class new class com dot cnotech okay util employee util Employee util. Now, what you will do? Public, static. Wherever the frequent logic we are using, public, static. Which employee you are using here? Non NFI. Non NFI. Okay. Now, get employee details. list of employees not one employee to avoid this okay to avoid this okay, utility stuff so jdk8 has introduced a one feature is called static methods to avoid this okay, utility wherever it is required instead of you will call this whole logic instead of you will call this whole logic Unnecessary okay, duplicate code it is. Employee util class. That's it. Wherever it is required, you might use this employee list in okay, six, seven classes. Don't write too much of code, boilerplate code. Write in one util. Util for utility classes. Util for utility classes. Wherever you, you required. Wherever you required, you can use it to team. Wherever you required, you can use it to team. Understood team? No. That's it. Now here, see, now what is our requirement here? First, I want to apply predicate. Predicate? No. Not my all example. Here, I just to type it okay yeah here see another class i don't want to use okay another class first all demo what i will do i need first employee details staff employee emp list Employee list is equal to list of employee. Employee list is equal to employee list is equal to. Now, next one. Okay, employee, okay, util. Wherever you want. Okay, utility class is used to 
if you want to use the same logic same piece of the code for multiple classes instead of instead of you will be okay instead of you will be you know use write that code in n number of places you know keep at one side wherever it is required you will get the data okay team now done how oh, here what is that predicate predicate okay now employee 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 p is equal to okay now e e e dot get salary e dot get salary is is less than 20,000 e dot get salary is less than 20,000 is my first requirement what is my okay, second requirement function input is employee input is employee input is okay, input is okay, employee and you know output is output is some string t input is a employee output is in some string now you should write what business logic you should write you have to write now what business logic we should write you have to write here understood team now now here okay, input is a employee output is this now you have to write all your logic e what is your logic you have to write all your logic now whoever got uh, okay, highest right now whoever got right now okay then you should give then we should give salary is an okay, integer how to write int int salary equal to e dot E dot int salary is equal to okay, employee right here. E dot int or integer. What happened? I need to write some logic. E dot go to here are okay right do we get the data here Why not oh e arrow e arrow it should get what wrong it is function employee a target expression of this must to be function interface a target expression to be function interface no into sal is equal to e dot get the salary plus okay team then again what we will do e dot set salary of sal method return result of string here return now i want to know i want to know i want apply this salary i want to know apply this salary or i would give him some grade team whoever is got uh, whoever is got salary is based on the salary I would give some grade. I would give some grade. Okay. Whoever is more salaries are there. I would give some grade. One second. Okay. Return type is okay. If 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 salary no need to one write one extra line unnecessarily. If e dot get 
salary is greater than or equal to 30,000. He is a manager. Return. He is a manager. Like that, we are writing some logic stream. Else if, else if salary is, you know, else if salary is greater than or equal to, uh, you know, 20K, 20,000, he is a return, return, okay, senior employee or something, okay, greater than or equal to 10,000. Instead of greater than, you can write equal equal because here we know our logic would happen only depend on. Now here equal equal 10,000 then he is the normal just employee. So what is the use of this functions use method must result of type of string here we are using string only right all are string else else no he is not written he is an admin guy not an employee he is a just kind of admin okay else that's it team that's it this is what how how it will be executed how it will be executed Understood team. Now, so until now we did for like everything. We did for uh, you know predicate. We did for uh, you know function. Now, next what is left to team? Left is now here. Consumer. Consumer. Employee. Consumer employee. Consumer by why it is not coming to you. We have imported consumer. No, we did not import. We have imported predicate. Why you are not imported function? Why it was not happening? Let me here we need our main method. Done, yeah. Function also it should done. Yes. Now next one. Always okay. Try the comment team. Consumer. How the consumer stuff is there? Consumer. Employee. How the consumer stuff is there? we are not applying this as a consumer consumer okay we'll write employee employee e, e arrow e arrow i am writing here lambda expression team i am writing here lambda expression whatever you want you can write this lambda expression system dot out dot intel n is out as a consumer but does not return anything so here whatever in our one second team one, one second team eclipse got struck here depends upon the requirement team only thing is lambda expressions to avoid to avoid implementation classes okay, okay instead of you will write all the classes in one separate class in the same class only you can write all this stuff same class only you can write all this stuff meanwhile we could start to write third one team what is third one Primitive, primitive, consumer, okay, primitive, consumer, 
when we should go for primitives primitive when we should go for intro okay, okay primitives to improve to improve application application performance to improve application performance we should go for we should go for primitive interfaces to improve application performance we should use we should use primitive interface to improve application performance we should use primitive interface we should use primitive interface okay now here see same story team if you know when you should go for a primitive if we know if we know okay if you know our input is our input is always always primitive values always okay primitive values then use 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 primitive interface use okay primitive work interface some of the okay primitive work interfaces are okay what are the okay, primitive work interfaces three primitive primitive consumer interfaces are primitive consumer work interfaces are one is primitive consumer interfaces are one is one is here for okay int consumer int consumer int consumer here what is the method here public void accept here always our input is int only always our input is okay int only understood team other one is other one is now here see long consumer long consumer public void accept accept long public void accept long long third one double consumer public void accept double okay all are used for only one argument team all are for one argument these are all for these are all for one argument team you have to know all for one argument okay these are called one argument these are these primitive primitive interfaces are primitive interfaces are one argument argument consumers now same we should go for this fourth one object int object int consumer here always okay, input is object sorry always here it is an buying consumer team first argument is an object second argument would be an primitive in this case what you will do you know public void void accept accept you have to give first argument is an object second object is an integer we'll see same for fifth we'll see same for sixth here object to long object to double here what happened here long here what happened here double that's it team depends upon the requirement you should use 
So this kind of here, okay, primitives are there only for use for one argument primitives input because your output is not there. You can't use any output here. Here two argument of inputs are there. How to write these two arguments are this. Understood. Let's see it in. Is it okay now? Yeah. Now here you should add here. How to add here? System dot out dot println. Problem with Eclipse team. E dot name name E dot get name get ID no get what is your designation? If you want to add one more. See, if you are using lambda, right? No need to uh, create okay, chatters and getters every time. If you use lambda, right? No need to create a chatters and getters okay, every time here. So just, I want to go for here, employee ID. What is your employee ID? What is your employee name? And what is your designation team? What is the designation? How I will get this? Very, very important. A functional interface is called f dot apply. I am passing employee. If you are passing your employee, these are the okay, displaying okay, employee ID, okay, employee name. Wherever okay, functional interfaces are there, I am passing whole employee objects here. I am passing here whole okay, employee okay, object here. This employee object will be taken care. This employee object will be taken care to, to execute this whole function. It will result the output. It will result the output. In lambda expression cannot re-declare local variables. Means this one somewhere we are using E. You should use here consumer. Okay. Here EMP. Here you can use EMP. That's it. Thing. Okay. Now how to call this one now we'll see now actual our program of execution would be there for employee e colon list what list it is employee list now here see if predicate P dot test of EMP. P dot test of EMT. Then okay. Here is my consumer. C dot. I accept it. Whoever, whenever line number 52 will be executed. Whoever the okay, employee, whoever the okay, employee is, is you know, uh, is okay, greater than or equal to 30 is there. I am writing my logic. Okay. You know, okay, execute every time for okay, accept. While executing accept, it should apply for your function. What is this function here? This lambda expression will be executed. That's it, team. So, okay, depends upon the requirement. You should use both predicate, both functions, you know, both consumers. Okay, it's all okay, depends, team. Now, here, see, right click on it. Run as Java application. See, okay, designation is manager. Why? If the all okay, greater than or equal to is there, 
first one look it will be executed okay here greater than or equal to 20000 means only this one only will come so that value would be coming here so if the that that value is here now here what is that uh, only this if condition will execute only for greater than or equal to 20000 means only one employee object only that employee object what is the employee salary based on the salary we are trying to get is role team is a designation team that's it that's it okay this one right okay. test means what instead of you will write your if conditions if employee greater than or equal to zero instead of you will write conditions we are going to use a predicate we are passing each and every employee object every employee object this while this for each loop will be executed flow will go to where here it will verify is this salary is greater than or equal to 20, uh, greater than 20,000 or not yes if it is yes if you have 10 employee objects only two employees only greater than or equal to 20 two times this accept will be executed okay sir. while executing while executing accept again inside of the your consumer you have please execute my function interface it will go for function interface function interface again you are passing same employee object here what is your logic see here already you have you, you are filtered your employee object this employee object what salary is there with that salary it will execute your business logic here it will give the output to you in two argument by consumer access method should contain two two inputs only in two arguments by consumer may be in copy paste issue yes yes you are correct you you here p comma u yes you are correct who has observed this thiru yeah good good yeah 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 good good yeah thank you team here two arguments will come here also and then write here also two will come here see always if it is okay two arguments means now let's see i will start my till now we have discussed one argument now by consumer new class by consumer by consumer demo how to create this you can see this source code team by consumer see two two arguments inside of this what method is there and then you have a input is by consumer two arguments two arguments same thing i did t. understood are we clear sir okay, everyone no so how this by consumer okay simple example would be there simple here take this two arguments take this two arguments take this okay two arguments one second before by consumer right we should go for consumer chaining we should go for consumer chaining sir chaining or joining both are same chaining means what combined one or two or more two or more consumers two or more consumers into single consumer is called is called consumer chaining is called consumer chaining and then and then is is a default method and it is used it is used to perform perform group of group of all the group of all the 
consumer objects group of all the consumer objects okay, syntax one is now consumer one and then consumer two okay and then consumer three and then and so on accept apply it apply it it depends upon the requirement you should use apply it okay depends upon the requirement you should use okay that's it okay now how to do it team now go for this by by consumer we'll see again go for this one consumer demo only you should create so simple team here you need to create two three consumer objects need to create two three consumer objects okay two three consumer object so now apply this apply this all this consumer objects into one consumers team apply this all this consumer object into one consumer object how to do it that will okay will explain thing how to do it i would explain in okay, next class already time is 17 hey tomorrow we would plan for supplier i would explain first to 15 minutes by consumer work example and we would discuss about consumer primitive okay, examples team and next topic is predefined and open interface is called supplier team predefined okay, interface is called supplier team so after that if you see team we are following okay, everything we are not okay, denying here where is our jdk eight features everything you can i will send this also to your email we did for predicate functions now we are working on consumer once it is done we will start for supplier parallelly we done for by predicate by function by consumer also will be done but there is no you know by occasion supplier i would explain tomorrow after that, we have unary operator and binary operator. Once it is done, we have done with the default methods static also. Our famous, very, very valuable, uh, you know, okay, API is called stream APIs. We are going to discuss all the methods in stream APIs. All. Okay. And also, we will use this method reference operator. Optional is a very simple topic team. Max one hour it will be enough. But stream API it would take around you know it would take around minimum minimum it would take uh, okay 10, 10 classes team okay that will okay, okay, discuss in okay upcoming classes team.